Yo, what's up YouTube and welcome back to another FIFA 22 video. Now, this video is a little bit later than normal just purely because of my coin balance. I did want to try and get some of my investments sold off. I just feel like they can go up a little bit more and I want to make the max amount of profit on it. So I have invested 900,000 coins into tonight's team uh, 2 basically. Uh, which is, you know, guaranteed pretty much money. Anyone that was subbed to me on Twitch would have got all these investments earlier on in the morning. Some people have already made 100k plus on a couple of cards that we put in a list for you guys. So don't forget, you know, you sub to me on Twitch. Link that Discord to your Twitch account and get yourself into the sub chat, guys. Okay, also I'll be streaming over there all weekend. So come and say hi to us. Also, tonight is going to be shadow trading and just other sort of like trading methods around with some other filters. Just give you a little bit more knowledge on what else you can do on the market. Uh, and let's see if we can hit, you know, 150 likes in the first 24 hours. So let's get straight into this because this is basically what we want, right? So we got 26,000 coins. Not really much, but I will show you quickly what I've invested in. And you guys can still invest in these. Now, what we've gone for is we've gone for the links into the new cards that have come out in Team 2. So, you know, we picked up this guy here for 165,000. He's actually going for about 172 right now. Okay, he will go a little bit more. As you can see, there's an open bid there for 168. I feel like he probably will hit maybe 180, 190. So I'm going to try and make some money off him. Obviously, Tadic. Okay, again, we picked up for 21 and a half out. Uh, sorry, 21 and, and a quarter. He's going for about 23K. Okay, I'm not going to go through every single one of these, but Carrasco, I think Carrasco is the only one that's down right now. Okay, oh no, okay, he's gone back up. So, that's all right, he's going to be about 41k at the moment. I'm going to wait for him to go more. Again, as you can see, we've got this guy here. Okay, 26 and a half thousand coins. He's not really risen, but it's all good. But these are the ones that we're on about. So, at the start of the week, I told you guys to pick some of these up. 22 and a half thousand coins. Now, if we go and have a quick look, okay... Uh, we're going to go and see what we can sell him at right now because I'm pretty sure he's already up at about 26, 27k. Uh, now, I did say this card will rise and I did expect it to go to 28, 29,000 coins. So please don't make me wrong. Okay, let's have a quick look. Oh, there's. Oh, every time I do that. Okay, so there you go. So I'm already about two and a half. That's 3,000, 4,000 coins up on this card already. Okay, as you can see, there's one at 28,000 coins. So, if you're in my Discord, you would have got told about this investment. If you're subbed to me on Twitch, you would have been told is an earlier, guys. So, it's definitely worth having this uh, this card. I mean, he's going to go up. He will start dropping tomorrow. So, maybe the correct time is to start selling it now. But purely because I've got four, I'm going to sell three. Okay, and then I'm going to keep one just for the game. Because I feel like... There's more room for that. I, I'm happy because he won't drop any lower than what I've already already bought him at. I bought him at his absolute lowest. So as you can see there, okay, we get an Hernandez sold. Okay, we'll tell you about that one in a minute. So let's go and get uh, some of these Jack Grealishes sold. Okay, so we're going to go up to 20, 28.5, I think it was. So there's 6,000 coins on that one. So after EA tax... I've made myself, you know, probably about five and a half thousand coins, which is not too shabby uh, to come the least on that one. Look at that. Again, I think I bought one of these a little bit more. Yeah, 23 and a half thousand there. Okay, and I'm going to put that one up. So there you go. We've made ourselves about 15k profit just on three cards. Now, I could have, should have bought more. Again, as you can see, okay, we've got some more. And we picked up some of these just in case. And you guys can do this as well right now. I picked these up. They probably will go cheaper. I picked them up for 14,000. You could get these for about 13 too. If you snipe them, maybe into the late 12s. But if they drop another SBC where it requires one of these cards, you're going to make money. And I'm pretty much guaranteed it will drop. So just get some of those picked up. Isn't if it's only like six or seven. I uh, picked up De Bruyne up because he's a strong link to Folden's new card. And then obviously these are just other strong links into it. The other thing you can do is pick up some silver informs ready for when the silver stars come out or some of the objectives that with a silver player. The informs always go to about 20, 21, 22k. Okay, we've picked them up for 14,000. Uh, I think some of them are 13,000 as well. So just get them as cheap as you can and stock them. Just hold them there. So let's get straight into it because we waffled on for about five minutes and we've not really done anything right now. So, you know, okay, Bosch, I mean, they're pretty much, are they sold? Are they sold already? I think we sold them. Yep, there you go. Jack Grealish is sold. It's 15k in my back pocket. I will take that. Thank you very much. And now we're up to 111k to play with. So the first filter we're going to get into 
okay, is we're going to get over into the Germany league, okay? We're going to go to Germans. We're going to go French, and we're going to go Defenders, okay? And we're going to go Gold Rare. Now, what this brings up here, okay, this is going to bring up some players at about 800 coins, uh, but there is other cards that we're chasing, okay? The next thing you want to do is then hit up the Shadow. Now, this is going to extend more money onto this, okay? Now, what you're going to be looking at, I'm not going to sit here and try and snipe these, but this Hernandez did come from this sort of filter. As you see, he's 1.8k. That is 100% a snipe right there. I should have literally gone for that. Uh, but as you can see, 2.3, okay, is what you're kind of looking at for this filter. And that's all of them. That's every single card coming out. As you can see, 2.4. Okay, so if we just quickly look here, see if we can get one coming out. This is every single card in this league that's a defender and French. Okay, you've got to have it as a French because it will narrow it down from some of the uh, trash cards. And all you basically do is just sit here and, you know, you can refresh on the market on the 59th minutes. Or you can just carry on, just refreshing back. Those fireworks are going mental. Um, again, I mean, let's go up to 2.7. As you can see, the Hernandez there, we sold at 2.6. I actually picked them up pretty cheap. I think it was about 1.9 with a shadow. So just bear that in mind, guys. There's 2.5 there. Don't go bidding on anything that's not already there, okay? So what we could actually do is I'll show you how to make this into the 59th minute filter if we can. Okay, so we're going to go to 2.4K. Okay, well, actually, we'll go down to 2.6. Uh, does that put it on? There you go. So now you can sit there with the 59th minute sniping. Now, how, you, how it works is you've got to have one past the hour, okay? One past the hour. So we know that that, that card there sells for about 2.3. Okay, we know Hernandez sells for 2.6. So anything kind of below those, we will pick up. And then if you pick up the other guy... Obviously, you know he sells into about the 3Ks, okay? So, again, here we go. We're going to just sit here and quickly look to see if we can get any popping up. If not, we're going to move into other filters. This is going to be great towards the later part of the evenings, okay? Because people are selling off players right now for SBCs, for one of the new cards. They'll forget that they put a shadow on it, and you'll be able to pick it up and make a steal, okay? There's loads of other ways of making coins. Again, I will be dropping another load of filters into the sub discord later on so that you guys have got even more filters to play with each day and then the live investments as well so as you can see nothing's really popping up for a second okay remember so the main thing with this is you want to make sure your cards the cheapest on the market okay you don't want to be sat there holding loads of cards for a while because you may have to list some of these up okay so like this card will sell at 2.4 you could probably even sell it at 2.5 2.6 but it will take a few times to uh, to list it up, okay? As you see here, nothing's really popping up. So I'm going to go into another filter. So we're going to go and switch over now. We're going to go to Prem, okay? And with the Prem, we are going to go Brazilian uh, Midfield. And we're going to go Gold Rare, okay? And then we're going to hit up the Hunter this time because, you know, it's attacking. And that there with the Midfielders will bring you up some cards. So let's go and have a quick look what you can bring up. Okay, now the chances are of catching a Firmino at this sort of price is not very high, but you do have the Jesus and that sort of, that's the ones like we're kind of chasing. So we're going to go and find the base value of this, okay? Now you do have um, this guy here, Rich, okay? He pops up quite a bit, but as you see here, okay, we actually got one at 1.6 there. He's not selling, but he will sell. But what you can do is just mass bid it. Okay, this is going to be your mass bidding filter for today. So 1.8k, I mean, you can see they will sell. You just have to keep relisting them. If we go to here, let's go 1.4. You literally want to mass bid across the field here. Okay, uh, there will be obviously not that many on the market. So just bear that in mind. I know a lot of people are going to be fighting over these tonight. But remember this in the future, guys. Okay, this is, I'm, I'm trying to teach you guys more filters that will help you out during you know going forwards into fifa okay there's a lot of stuff that we can cover uh so that's that there but i mean if you don't like that sort of sniping okay what you can do is just go uh premier league okay defenders english okay and man U. this here brings up quite a few cards as you can see here okay you've got Maguire, you've got shaw you've got van biska okay uh is there one more i don't think there is one more i think it's just the three cards so this here is going to be a really good one to be sniping. Okay, obviously you want to put it on gold. Uh, don't be like me there. There you go. So we're looking at about 2.2 on those. Okay, let's go a little bit higher, see what we're at. 
2.4. I mean, you you could have picked up those 2.2s easy. It's about 2.6. Yeah, so 2.6 is for... Who is it? It's Maguire and Shaw, okay? But obviously, you've got the right back as well, Van Bisca. He sells her a little bit more. I think he's about 3.1. So what we're going to do is we're going to knock this down to 2.3. Okay. As you can see, there's tons of cards that are below that. So let's go 2.2. Okay. I'm actually going to pick that one up. I'm going to sell it on for about 2.5. Um, 2.6. Someone will buy that card. It's an 8.4 rated. Uh, they'll use it for an SBC. Someone lazy. Okay. Remember what we're selling for? We're selling for 2.4, 2.5. Oh, oh, we can actually sell it 2.6. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we can actually sell at 2.6, 2.5k straight away. Yeah, so I mean, I could have even listed out for 2.8 for lazy. Uh, so what we're going to go is we're going to go 2.3 and below, okay? Now, as you can see here, there is some cards. I'm going to pick them up, okay? Let's get those two listed up as well. I am running out of transfer space as well, so I've got to be careful of that. So 2.6, again, 2.6. These will sell. may have to relist them a couple times. It is only 100 or 150 coins per card profit. But again, you can go a little bit lower here. Okay, I mean, that would have been like 500 coins or yeah, 400 coins. There's another one popping up, 2.2. You just got to be quick on these. Okay, well, as you see, I've got 2.2 there. If I go and list this one up for about 2.5, okay, that's a nice little bit of profit there. I'm not going to get that one for 2.1 because I'm way too late on it. Okay, and you can just sit here and do this. Now, if you get bored of this, you can also go to the mass bid inside. Which, again, is pretty sick. I love mass bidding this year. Uh, 1.3. Okay, you can just go like 1.5. Just scatter your bids around. Or, you know, if you know you can win. If you catch one at 1.2 and you win it at 1.2, then just keep bidding 1.2 because you will get them. The same as if you go 1.9, 1.8, blah, blah, blah. All that sort of stuff. They will uh, get through. If you're mass bidding, you mass bid 50 of the same card, you're guaranteed to get about 10 of them, guys. Unless you're trying to be really tight and make huge profit. So, there's the Man U sort of one, okay? But there is also the Shadow Trading itself, which is every single card. Now, with this here, okay, you want to get to 59th minute sniper. Now, if we quickly look, you can get past this with... Oh, there's one there at 900. I didn't expect one to pop up. Uh, anything 1.1 is a buy it already, okay? It's an instant sell. So, what we're going to go is we're going to go 1.2, okay? And as you see, they don't sell straight away at 1.2. These will list... Okay, a few times, depending on what card you get. And you literally just sit here, refreshing, okay? Square and circle, square and circle. And as you can see, there's one there that pops up at 1.2. Okay, and we're going to keep searching for a second. We're just going to see what cards we can pick up. Oh, there's a... That's one there, wasn't it? We just missed that one. That's huge. Uh, we're just going to see what cards we can pick up, okay? There's one at 800 coins. That's guaranteed 500 coins profit. There's one at 1.1, okay? That's guaranteed some profit from Dipple. Uh, 1.2... 1.2 okay so there we go we've got stones okay so let's go and quickly check what stones price is now he might isn't be 1.2 1.3 but he's actually going to be at least 1.3 um purely because he's not in that list there that we were going up so john stones with a shadow okay let's go 1.4 so as you can see he's selling for about 1.4 now you could actually list them up for 1.6 if you really wanted to be greedy, I'm going to actually list them up at 1.5, okay, because I want I want those coins. I want the money. Um, I'm happy for them to sit on my transfer list for a couple times if I need them to. So let's go and list them up, okay. So we're going to put them up at 1.5. That's going to make us about 350 coins profit, okay. Uh, and what I'm actually going to do with this one here is I'm going to put this one up at 1.4. And I'm going to put this one up at 1.3 because I know he sells at 1.3, so I'm only making 50 coins off him. However, with this filter, you can get yourself any sort of deal, okay? You will literally be able to pick up cards that sell for four, five, six thousand coins, okay? Uh, people do list them up. I know it's really weird that people would list a high rated card super cheap. Uh, bear in mind, this isn't got a shadow on. I mean, it's just mind blowing. But as you can see here, okay, we got a few at 1.2. They will sell. They're just within the hour there, okay? As you can see, there's another one. Uh, that's the other thing, right? That's like what a lot of people don't do is they don't put themselves on the buy it now, okay? They literally just leave it on the bid. Uh, and I'll show you exactly what I mean in a second, okay? So we're going to go and check out Sissoko, okay? So let's quickly back that out. Let's go and quickly check his price. Sissoko. Wait, too so weird sometimes. There he is. Right, so with a shadow on, okay? We're looking at... Nice. 
we will take this. This is this is exactly what we're on about here, okay? He's actually going for 2.6k. That is a great, great snipe there, okay? I can literally list him up for 2.5k and sell him straight away, uh, which is what I'm going to do. 2.5k is what I'm going to sell him at. Let's go and quickly have a look what we picked him up for. Was it 1-1? One, one? I think it was 1-1. One, one. Yeah, 1-1, one, one, and we're selling him off at 2.5. That is almost, well, it is double my coins. Easy. And uh, yeah, that is that's a perfect way to end that filter, guys. That will make you an absolute ton of money uh, in the long run. You can make thousands and thousands of coins on that filter. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm going to leave it there. There's no better way to finish that other than getting a 10k card or an 8k card. But I'm not, I'm not going to sit here and do that, guys. I want to keep it a short video and get it uploaded. But... Like I said, if you're new around here, hit that sub button, please, guys. We're coming up to 7.1k. The views are a little bit low at the moment. So let's see if we can get 50 comments on this video, guys. Let's see if we can get anyone to change the lights. Let me know what color you want to see the lights in the next video or something. With that said, though, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.